G'day, Sam Bow here. The Waratah bush is budding up fairly well. Another couple of weeks and these flowers will be open. Gen they generally open up end of September, early October. And when they're open I can sell them for about $2 each. Anyway, today's job. I don't know if it's the right time to be doing this, but I'm going to give it a go. I'm going to take some cuttings and I'll put them in my grow bed and see just how well they can take off. If they work, great. If they don't, I haven't really lost anything. All right, got some cuttings. Actually, that one there. This one here, I'll take the tip off of them. Bit of insect damage there. So I've just taken some cuttings, reasonably fresh growth. Taken one larger, more established branch. Shorten that one up a bit. That one. Rooting gel for hardwood cuttings. How can you tell if your plants are hardwood? Because it has leaves. to put them in the ground. All right, Waratahs are in. Just water the whole bed now. And then I'll give an explanation of what I've got. All right, I've taken some cuttings here from a type of eucalyptus. I think it's South Australian blue gum. I don't, it doesn't look like they're gonna make it. Now they've browned off, but under the ground there's still a bit of green there. Uh, sultana cuttings. As you can see there, that's taken nicely. There's my waratahs I just did. Gordo cuttings here. I think they'll get going. A couple of them will anyway, the buds are starting to swell up. Come around this side for a better look. Flame seedless. Table grape. Buds are starting to swell up on there, so I think I might just get some, get them going as well. On the way from Canberra to the shack, there's probably, there's probably at least a hundred apple trees, self-sown apple trees on the side of the highway. In an area just outside of Cooma called Bobundra, there's an apple tree that you might have seen in another video where I was pruning it. Produces good apples. Self sown. So I've taken some cuttings. And as you can see there, it looks like they're going to take. So I've basically got my own variety of apple tree. And because they're a sweet apple crisp, and from Bobundra, I've called it Sweet Bobundra. Now you can grow apple trees from seed. But there's no guarantee what, what you're going to get. The seed will not turn out like the parent plant because of the way they grow. Apple trees have male and female flowers, but you need two trees to pollinate each other. And so you'll get a mix. And where you've got a lot of different varieties, you can have two apples off the same tree and they'll have different seed. And that's why most apples that you buy in the shop they're propagated from cuttings and then grafted onto rootstock that has specific traits that the growers after. In my case I won't be grafting these on the rootstock, they'll be going straight in the ground. The parent plant seems to have done alright. It's probably about a foot across at the base. 
And I've just stuck these stands in. I'm going to put some um, bird netting over the top here. Maybe even a little bit of um, shade cloth just to help keep the frost off a bit. We're still in danger of a few frosts here. Because it's still early spring. So anyway, thanks for watching. And I'll see you in another video.